Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. I am Jules Julia. Thank you so much for watching. My hair looks really flipping red in camera. Right now I'm just using natural sunlight. We're not using the ring light. Let me know on the comments below. How does it look? What's up? I'm actually a little bit stoked because I haven't filmed in a while, but I've been trying, you guys. I'm literally trying to figure out my schedule because it keeps on moving. It's like, yo, I prefer closing. But then, like, they put me to close and open. And it's like, how, when am I going to have time to edit? I need my rest. And it's just like, ah. So, I started doing, just trying to figure out what's going on, what's going to happen. But anyways, you're here to watch what I bought at Ulta. Now, I went haywire on Ulta. Don't recommend it. Ow. I kind of, like, already started, like, putting things away, which is my fault. Because I should have done a video. But I bought three, I bought a one shipment, which came in four different days, which is, like, you know, but it's okay. It's okay. Some of the things that came in I already started opening and I wasn't thinking of doing a video like this, but we're doing a video like this. So let's get to the video. All right, now, first thing is first. I already started playing with this sucker right over here. If you guys follow me on my Instagram, you will know I took this baby with me to San Diego. I, I opened it immediately. As soon as I knew that she came in, I was so happy because I was able to travel with her and I have her and I love her and if you guys haven't tried it you guys are missing out the whole world first of all let me show you how beautiful Jackie's palette is it is like it, it it's just it's just I cried I started crying in my my person was just looking at me weird because I started crying Tears started falling from my eyes because as soon as I opened it, I was just crying hysterically. I was crying not only because it's a beautiful palette, look how beautiful it is. Not only I was crying because of the beautiful palette it is, but also the beautiful packaging it, it comes with. This holographic look, I mean, this is beautiful, you guys. This is so freaking beautiful. And by the way, we are so close of hitting a thousand subscribers. So, you know what? If we hit a thousand subscribers... October is my birthday month. If we hit a thousand subscribers before October, well, actually, during the month of October, I will be giving away one of these babies because I really, truly do love it, and I and I want you guys to also feel the same love that I have. But let's get back to this haul. As always, since I ended up buying this one, I wanted to buy this one, which this one is a strawberry scent. I haven't smelled it yet, so I don't know how does it smell, but I'm pretty excited because I do like their Morphe spray. And I do think it's in a reasonable price as well. Another thing that I ended up buying was I actually restocked it on this eyeliner. This is a liquid liner from Makeup Revolution. Then I also ended up buying this one right over here, which is my MAC Cream in Your Coffee. I... Not a big fan of it. I actually thought I was going to like it, but I don't really like it as much. I don't know. I was expecting it to be more on the nude side than the pinkier side, but it's okay. That's my fault. I'll leave that how it is. And then, of course, I ended up getting this one right over here, which is a bling bling mascara from Too Faced Better Than Sex. I just wanted to try it. It looks nice. Some of the stuff, like I said, I already opened them. I was already playing with them because boxes came in separate times. So, uh, you know. I also ended up getting this one from Makeup Revolution London. This is their loose powder in yellow. So I ended up restocking in one of each of the Mario Badescu. This is their um, facial spray with aloe, sage, and orange blossom. I really do like this one a lot. It smells wonderful, but I also do like their rose water and this one right over here, the chamomile one with lavender. It smells amazing. I didn't really like the green one, so I passed on that one. The aloe vera toner. Usually aloe vera breaks me out, but it's good for your skin. It's just not natural. Like the natural aloe vera on my skin breaks out, but I tried a lot of aloe vera products and I mean, it's good for my skin. It doesn't do bad, but I wanted to try out that toner as well as this one right over here, which is the glycerin acid toner. I'm going to start updating my skin routine. I want to try something new. I want to be able just to adventurize a little bit further more than what I just basically do to my skin. So I also ended up getting this product, which is Hydrate Fix Radiant Spray. It's a long lasting, well, long wear oil control with hydro acid um, from Makeup Revolution. And it's look like this, as well as I got the Conceal and Fix. I didn't really understand what this was, but it is a matte 
primer apparently. And it's shine free with, oh, it has salicylic acid, which is good for those who people who have acne like myself. Hmm. All right, I'll definitely be trying that out. Let me know in the comments. I would love you guys want to see a review. Then I have this one right here, which I haven't had my hands on it. Then we ended up buying this one, which is the Velvet Skin Facial Mask with Wild Orchids. Purple Rice Water from the brand Shea Moisturizer. I saw that they do have a lot of new products that are coming out. Most of them is sold out, so I'm like, that would be good. And then I ended up getting this one, which is their Glow Setter Serum Moisturizer C. It is honey and mango. So a lot of things that I bought were kind of new that I never tried out, that I never tested out. And some things are just refillable, you know. I actually ended up buying two of these um, because I like... I'm, I'm starting to like lip gloss, which is kind of scary. I did buy two of these as well. This is actually one I already started using. It's an okay product. I don't feel like it makes a huge difference. Um, I do believe it was really hyped up, but I mean, it's not a bad product. Then I ended up buying this one. It's called Stardust Glitter Eyeliner. It's an opal pink one. I thought it would be cute for like, you know, since Halloween is around the corner, we could do some Halloween looks, get some little glitter effects, get some opal looking effects. My other eyeliner from Makeup Revolution. Then we do have this lip balm from Mario Badescu. And I ended up buying this cool thing, which is, I actually wanted to buy two of them, but the other one was always sold out. This is actually a needle thing. Apparently, like, you roll it around your face and it brings out, like, the collagen into your skin, removes aging, makes your skin look better, firmer, you know. So I wanted to try it out. Like, I'm really intrigued to try it out to see how does, well does it work on my face. Then I ended up buying the Peach Baking Powder from I Love Revolution. And here we go with some more. This is the skin line from Revolution. I got the Mild Exfoliating, then I have the Blemish Pore Refined Serum, as well as this one that really intrigued me. It's a Pore Refined Peeled. It's a peeling mask for your pores, so it's like, hmm, I wanted to try it out to see what's up with it. Like, And I got myself some brow ones from Benefit Cosmetics. I do really love their, their brow items, but it's a little bit pricey to me. And I mean, I do have already a full set brow, I just fill in a little bit, so I kind of don't you know, I'm, I'm in that like need of not really needing it, but needing it at the same time. I ended up stocking up on some concealer of the Double Duty Beauty from Tarte. Love this concealer. Absolutely love it. Then I ended up also, because I'm almost, basically I'm actually done. This is the oil, I believe. Which one's this one? I don't remember. I don't know if I got the same one. But I actually already finished my Maracuya oil from the origins oh this is another one. Oh no i think i got the wrong one what is this marine hydrolacid lightweight hydration support <gasps> okay i bought the wrong one i thought i restarted okay but it's okay we'll try this one out they're really inexpensive they run less than ten dollars so for it to like hydrate your skin then i ended up buying these two babies i haven't tried these in a long time and I also ended up restocking on Shady on the Morphe. This is my favorite ultimatum lip cream. The other one melted and it just went, it just, it, it just, it just went RIP on me. Which is understandable because I've had it for probably like a while already. The beginning of this year. Love it though. I love it. I love it. I love it. This sucker right over here, which is a Star Mist North Star from Lime Crime. It's supposed to be like a glitter for your hair. Then I ended up buying this right over here. These are the ones I wanted to show you guys. I can't wait to try this out. These are new from Kiss, and they're like in a nice, like, I don't know. I, I can't wait to try these out. They're like in a wine color, but they look freaking beautiful. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you beauties in my next one. Don't forget, we're almost close to 1,000 subscribers. And when we hit that 1,000 subscribers, we'll be doing a giveaway.